What's going on you guys? I'm with Jesse here. Welcome to another Sundays with Jesse. I am going to give you guys a rundown of some of the stuff that I have been doing and working on this week. Uh, I have a project that I'm actively working on. These are for the upcoming Avengers Infinity War. These are Captain America's shields, the Wakandan shields that he has. So I printed these over on the Rays 3D N2 Plus printing uh, just vertically and it printed really nice. So I'm in the process of doing some cleaning on these. I was actually on Friday night trying to get it's my working? streaming setup going again. Ah, ah. And unfortunately I was just oh having a ton of issues. I probably spent 45 minutes just troubleshooting OBS on my Mac. Uh, finally was able to get connected and I think my, just my upload speed is just not well suited for streaming unfortunately. I might try and do something else. I have a feeling, honestly, if I wasn't using a Mac, it might work better. I don't have a PC or a laptop PC that I could use to test this theory out. I might try and do some streaming from my phone, but we'll see. I would love to start doing some live build work as I'm working on projects so you guys could see those. And, you know, chat with me while I'm working on them helps the time go by a little bit faster. But you guys can anticipate in the next few days, I will have the full finished build video of how I'm making these and finishing these on the channel here. Really looking forward to having these done in time for the movie's launch uh, again. And these files, by the way, are free from Nico Industries. I'll have a link down below where you can download them for yourself and go ahead and start printing them because they are pretty cool to print with and they print pretty fast and easy. I think this was maybe eight hours, 10 hours, 12 hours, something around there. Next up, working on some pistols here. These are from Colonius. Uh, this is for an upcoming J Aurora A5 printer review or overview that I'm working on. Uh, we'll also have some other prints that I'm working on with this, but this is just really cool. This is a Fortnite pistol, a silenced pistol that you can screw on and screw off the silencer for. It's too, too cool. This is just a really cool prop to have. Uh, I am in the process as well of comparing this to the CR-10, since I know a lot of you out there are gonna be asking immediately as I post that video, how does this compare to the CR-10? Which would I prefer? Would I prefer the CR-10 or the A5? Right now, it's a little bit up in the air. Uh, the A5 looks really cool. It's much quieter than my CR-10s. Uh, it was honestly a little bit easier to set up and get going with as well than the CR-10. Um, Price-wise, they're a pretty com comparable and the build volume is the exact same. And also my CR-10 Simplify 3D profile that I use for pretty much all my CR-10 printers, I was able to directly <laughs> use on the A5 as well, which is nice. Didn't have to you know really recalibrate or anything like that. It just has been working pretty dang nice and is really clean right from the get-go. So stay tuned for that. I'm hoping by the end of next week, that video will be out and good to go. So as some of you might know or might not be aware, I also do a podcast each week with a bunch of crazy folks for the Xbox uh, subreddit over on Reddit called the Xbox One Party Chat Podcast. Uh, we are coming up on our 100th episode this week, which is crazy that we've been doing this for two years now. Uh, and this week, as of today, if you're watching this on Sunday, you might be able to still get in on a giveaway that we're doing for Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. And I put together a little teaser video for the guys uh, to, for that giveaway, had a lot of fun with it, and printed this really cool looking bird skull that I ended up wearing on my forehead like one of the characters in the game <laughs> for the video. I'll put a link here, or maybe I'll just actually play it right now. Maybe you're already dead. Who are you? She once tried to make them go away. Mother, do you hear them? Pretend they weren't real. Who's that? Senua, focus your have you heard the lore of the Party Chat podcast? <coughs> they are giving away a copy of Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. Make sure you follow the Party Chat podcast and retweet this tweet to enter to win. Hurry, Senua! You don't have much time! They're coming! Run! She was 
will save his soul. Even if at this time she can't save her own. And speaking of that game, if you have not already played it and you have an Xbox or a PlayStation, I think it's even on PC, do yourselves a favor and download and play that and turn off all the lights and wear some headphones. That game is crazy. It is a lot of fun and it really uh, messes with you with the different audio talking into each of your ears uh, from multiple directions throughout the entire game. And speaking of gaming, uh, yeah, I picked this up this week. <laughs> So I picked up the PlayStation Pro. This is the God of War edition. This console is so ugly. It is so ugly looking in my opinion, but I was interested in picking up a PS4 Pro. Uh, the reviews for God of War have just been absolutely crazy, so I wanna check that out. Uh, I love Xbox and just gaming in general, so I have no qualms about picking up a PlayStation and playing some of these games. Looking forward to playing Uncharted 4. Uh, also, uh, we'll be getting for sure Last of Us 2. I loved The Last of Us. That might be one of my all-time, probably top five video games ever is The Last of Us. God, that game was such an amazing amazing and i've heard this is uh really top-notch god of war so looking forward to playing it and it came free with the console so i figured why not and i sold my original xbox one got some good cash for it from gamestop which i despise going to but it was too good of a deal to pass up had some credits laying around at best buy so picked this up for almost next to nothing which was absolutely Fantastic, because this bad boy is a little expensive. So I'm gonna keep it pretty short and sweet for this week. I just wanna say thanks for watching, you guys. Again, this is just my new moving forward on Sundays, sort of a weekly recap of maybe some stuff, some projects that I'm working on. I have a few other projects that I had been working on during the week that I'm not quite ready to share with you guys yet. Uh, also, I'm gonna see if I can run some sort of a poll. Uh, I have, let's say, probably around five or more actively ongoing projects that I have started and just not finished. And I don't think I've really shared a lot of them with you guys. Uh, what I might do is post a poll and ask you guys to vote and let me know what you'd like to see me finish out of these projects that I've already started. Help, you know, just motivate me to actually get these done before starting up, I don't know, 12 other projects, which I seem to do on a weekly basis of starting a million prints and never actually finishing them. But hey, thanks again for watching, you guys. Thanks for watching and staying tuned in here. Uh, I will see you guys next Sunday here. I just want to say thanks again for watching. Bye now.